Oh wow, these strawberries look amazing. Just picked this morning. Man, I bet it is just as good as they look. Oh sure, I would love a free sample. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Yep, I was right. <laughs> Let me see. I'll take. Oh. Oh, my bad. I, I didn't see your hand there. Wait a second. I know you, don't I? Yeah, you're the guy that visits my bento shop often. Of course, how could I forget a face like yours? Anyways, I wasn't expecting to see you here. How are you on this fine day? Me? I'm doing alright. Since my shop is closed for today, I figured I would go and snoop around a bit at the farmer's market. See if I can get some fresh fruits and vegetables. Same idea, huh? Hmm, say you're not actively stalking me, are you? <laughs> relax, relax. I'm just messing with you. This is probably just a chance encounter. The weather is nice today, after all. Yeah, I was just telling the vendor that these strawberries look delicious. And the best part, they just picked them this morning. So I, of course, was reaching for them when... Yeah, I guess the strawberries must have gravitational pull on us. <laughs> uh, yes, we'll take these. Here you go. Thanks. Well, I'm going to look around some more and I'm sure you have more shopping to do anyways. Hmm? Sure, we can shop the market together. I honestly don't have anything else planned after this, so... Yeah, let's go. <sighs> Everything is so nice here. Wouldn't you agree? Hey, are you okay down there? I was asking because I figured most people don't like the idea of walking around with someone who basically can see the top of their heads. <laughs> Tends to make them uncomfortable. Which is something I don't want. You sure don't mind it? Well, alright then. Oh my goodness, look at those flowers. <laughs> they look gorgeous. <laughs> and they smell nice. Want to give them a whiff? What? Y you're not allergic, are you? Uh, if so, then I I'm sorry. I didn't mean to just plop the flowers near to your face. Oh, I take it. Y you're not... How is it? Uh, what? They smell like me? <laughs> Okay, that honestly was pretty funny. Thanks for the compliment anyway. That was... That was nice. I'm wondering if I should pick up a few for my place. I'm sure it would help it look a little nicer. No, not my shop. I meant my apartment. Which I may need to move out at some point. No, not just the rent. But boy, let me tell you. Living in this economy with rent going up is a struggle. But anyways, I was thinking about moving out because it's honestly a little cramped for me. You know, it's bad when you can literally touch the ceiling without getting on your tippy toes. I took it because it was the cheapest option at that time. That and it's closer to the bento shop around, so yeah. But anyway, these tulips are nice. But I feel like I need something with a little more. Hmm? Greenery. Huh. You're right. This might do the trick. Thanks. Speaking of greenery, have you tried the artisanal apple cedar? 
No? Oh man, you're missing out. Come with me for a second. Don't be so shy. Come on, it's not that far. And this here is one of my favorite spots at the farmer's market. May I have one, please? No, no. <laughs> Not the bottle this time. Just a cup, please. Thanks, and here's the cash. Mm -hmm. Here, take a sip. Go on. How is it? See, I told you it was good. Hey, mind if I... <laughs> mm. Thanks. Uh, sorry, I was feeling a bit thirsty. Oh, it's fine. I didn't feel like buying another cup for myself, so... Hey, are you okay? Well, you look like you're in a daze or something. Oh, my bad. I guess I wasn't thinking about how it could be seen as an indirect kiss or something. M my bad, here. Um, I can go get you a new cup and... It's fine. Well, alright, if you say so. May as well get a jar of honey while we're passing by it. Yeah, sometimes I put honey in my tea. It's healthier than throwing in packets upon packets of those artificial sweeteners. Though I use the term healthier loosely, since I kind of just pour it in, <laughs> rather than measure by teaspoons or whatever. Of course, to help sweeten it. Speaking of sweeten things, you decided to... Accompany me as we roam this market together is awfully sweet of you. Maybe I'm overstepping here, but I've noticed that you're awfully quiet. Even when you visit my bento shop. So that begs the question. Why do you visit my shop so often? Hmm? You just like the place? Or maybe you just wanted to come by... And see a tall pretty thing like me? <laughs> Relax, my guy. <laughs> Relax. I was just teasing you again. But still, if you only came to see me, then... Well, it's nice. Most folks would be intimidated by a giant such as myself. <laughs> yeah, right. I'm not a fool. I basically tower over half the people I interact with every day. Needless to say, I know some of those people tend to make fun of my height behind my back. It's usually the idiots and drunks that say to my face. So I just embrace it now. I can't change my height, honestly. I wouldn't waste money or manpower trying to. If people want to call me a giant, then fine by me. As long as they aren't trying to start a fight with me or something. What's that? Hey, 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 no, don't apologize. That is, that it doesn't bother me as much as anymore. Thanks for being concerned about me, though. That's very sweet of you. <laughs> My goodness. Do you smell that? Hmm, it smells like freshly baked bread. Hmm, hmm. these baked goods stand uh, looks and smells fantastic today. Ooh, free samples. Thank you. Mm. Mm, this is good. How's yours? Yeah, let me get this. Uh, uh, 
<laughs> nice to see we both have good taste. Man, I didn't think I would be going home with so much stuff today. Usually when I heat up the market, I tend to leave with just one or two things. But I guess I just couldn't help myself this time around. What about you? I hope our little adventure wasn't too much for you. Good, glad to hear that. <laughs> huh? Oh great, and now it starts to rain. Man, I didn't bring an umbrella either. My, 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 look at you. Mr. Ready for anything. Oh, we have a bit of high difference though. Tell you what, how about a trade? I'll let you hold some of what I'm carrying and I'll hold the umbrella. Hmm? Oh, come on, I can't let you carry everything while I hold the umbrella. That would be unfair. And probably a strain on those short but firm muscles of yours. Let me at least carry these. Okay. <laughs> there we go. Now let's get moving. I'm thinking maybe we should stop at my bento shop. It's not too far from here. Plus, we'll at least have some shelter from the rain. Hey, you don't have to be so far out. Why don't you come closer? It's fine. I don't mind you getting up in my personal space a bit. Besides, I would be doing a terrible job as an umbrella holder if you're still getting wet. Come on, come closer. Still shy? <laughs> Alright, let me help you out a bit. Let's say I were to wrap my lengthy arm around you like this. Better? You know, I can't help but notice that. You're barely at my chest level. <laughs> you must be getting a pretty good view down there, huh? <laughs> don't be so nervous. I don't bite, I swear. Man, the rain sure is picking up. Oh, look out! Ah, oh, you prick! Slow down next time! You okay there, short stuff? Yeah? Thankfully, I used the umbrella to block most of the splash damage. Sorry about suddenly grabbing you like that. Are you sure you're okay? Your face is as red as the strawberries. And you look... sweaty? Uh, okay... Hey, can I ask you something? I know I asked about why you come to my shop so much, but I really want to know. What is it about my small little shop that makes you want to come it so often? Honestly, it isn't much to look at, both outside and inside. What do you mean? Hey, you can tell me. I, I won't judge. Hmm. So wait, let me guess this straight. I was the one who drew you into my shop? Can I ask what it is about me that drew you in? I see. What? No, 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 that's not weird. That's not weird at all. If anything, I'm just... shocked. I mean, most folks that I met would hardly say it was the slender man-sized lady that brought them. But rather, the food. Or it's low prices, but you seem like first guy me to generally enjoy seeing me. Wait, I guess this means that you were super shy about talking to me, right? Yeah, the look on your face and the fact that you're awfully quiet says it all. <laughs> I'm cool? Well, thanks. Thanks, that means a lot. Here we are. Let me just unlock the door, okay?
Just set everything down over there. Here's your umbrella. Hmm. It'll take a minute for the stove and everything to warm up. And I'm sure you must be hungry. Oh, how about we share these strawberries we got while I wait for everything? Obviously it's going to take a while. Plus I'm hungry. So we may as well. Mm, these are so good. Mm. <laughs> Here, come on, don't dance up on me, short stuff. Here, take it. There you go, that wasn't so bad now, was it? Hang on, can I grab your wrist for a second? Relax, I'm not going to hurt you. I just want to take this strawberry off your hands. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Seems a certain someone is enjoying the view, huh? <laughs> Cute. Here, yeah, so... Are we just going to keep feeding each other strawberries? Or is there something you want to say to me? I mean, there is an elephant in the room. <laughs> you can only ignore it for so long. Listen, you said it yourself. You came to my shop because I seem like something you can marvel at for hours, right? And I can't help but to tease you a bit whenever you get shy and embarrassed like this. You may have a thing for my height, but that's not the only reason why you're so invested in me. And you absolutely do not make fun of me for my height. If anything, you're nothing but supportive and sweet. I could even say, you're as sweet as these strawberries. <laughs> Earlier, you mentioned something about an indirect kiss. Why are you apologizing? I didn't see it as a bad thing. Plus, I did drink out of the same cup as you, didn't I? I think it's becoming clear that there is something we both want. How about I help you take that first step? Hmm? Your cute blushing face is so mesmerizing to look at. Come on, short stuff. You can do it. Look at me. There we go. Now tell me. Tell me what you always wanted from me. You're going to ask me for something, right? Well, do it. There's no one else here. It's just you and me. W well, I don't if you can. Considering we were already on a date earlier. <laughs> What do you think, sweetie? Yeah? I would love to go out with you again sometime. Honestly, today was so much fun with you around. That and well, I've been eyeing you up too. Ever since you first stepped into my shop. <laughs> I always thought you were cute. And today pretty much confirmed it to me. So, how about short stuff? Will it be okay for me to call you that? Cool. I'm going to head to the back and whip up your favorite free of charge. Sounds good. Good. Can't wait to see you enjoying it.